Well, welcome to the Oracle NetSuite Open 2022 edition here in San Francisco. And a completely new venue here in the old steelworks. Completely renovated building. There's going to be a lot going on here in the next few years. Squash is one of the first things taking place in these in this area of San Francisco. Well, Tomato Ho of Hong Kong is 34 in the world currently, and that's her highest ranking so far, 26 years of age. Has been on tour for seven years now. 50% record in terms of gaining trophies in finals. Great deal and in the game of squash from New Zealand. She's five in the world, but she has been as high as number three. It's pretty much beaten uh, all of the top players at some stage. 34 years of age now, in the twilight years of her career. She's been on the tour now for the best part of 20 years and amassed 14 titles from 27, which is an amazing record and won countless Commonwealth medals and a very impressive 63.7% win rate do with the best of three format and then that change later on in the week towards the best of five that's always kind of a fascinating mind game I think that the players have to play with themselves effectively playing two different tournaments in one but yeah I think we're in for a treat this week with the squash yeah absolutely I think this will did well to take the route behind Joel King she there. did yeah that was a nice line and now you can see just a bit of light coming through in, the, in these daytime matches, but the front wall has been covered. So obviously, Tomato Ho will be aware of that. She's just trying to rush and harry her Kiwi opponent as much as possible. That's nice. Ooh. It's really nice. How quickly was she onto that boast? Very, very high prep on the backhand. Really steep. Yeah, very Coming deceptive. Through, you can yep. see yeah, it could have gone to any corner. It's very good at controlling the middle of the court. Oh, that's a great get from Smart Ho. I'm not sure. Did she get that one? She, she may have done. <laughs> she scraped three, that one too. Three retrievals. The, the fourth one was just a little bit too much Six. for Tomato Ho. Good holding play from the Kiwi on that backhand side. Just keeping it nice and simple. Not trying anything outrageous at this point. Yeah, yeah tight, wasn't it? And the boast was high. The boast was high and you can and see Tomato Ho's rack of preparation as she gets points. goes into that ball. She, she takes her time, she gets the racket head above the wrist and then she can do a lot of things with that. Tight work from King, but even tighter the lift from Ho. Oh, she's just Throw gone, ten. tried to hit it nice and low from the Into back of the King. court, just clipping the top King. of the tin. And it's Joel King just squeezing after a bit of a dodgy start from her point of view. Coming through, she leads by one game to love. Best of three format until the semi finals here. You're allowed two reviews in the first two games, and if they Three are one. unsuccessful, you're allowed one more in the decider. Oh, snapping it through. Two, three. Service punished. Yeah, a little bit poor, wasn't it? Straight onto the racket of King. Got it, she could have got it, but that's not Why the whole she? point. Yeah, exactly. See, that's good movement from Holt. Yeah, she certainly uh, moves well around the court. Holt, speedy. She's got a lot of balls back here. Clipping the top of the tin, a now bit of pressure there, perhaps from the amount of balls that are coming back from the Hong Kong player. 
certainly not an easy run for Joel King here. That's a brilliant volley from high up. What a get again. Brilliant work. High up from Joel King and Smarta Ho showing unbelievable athleticism again. But King was equal to it and she's now got four match balls. Six. Match oh, good performance, a very experienced performance from Joel King 12, against 10, a, 11, a lively Tomato Ho, just coming off the back of a, an important win against her teammate, a revenge win. But it's Joel King, the number two seed here, coming through 12 10, 11 6 in 23 minutes, winning two games to love. somebody who's young and who's coming on and who you don't necessarily have a lot of experience against and that first game showed it what were you thinking as you got to overtime in the first game um to be honest it's the, the best of three can be quite a leveler like i know the for entertainment value it's always a, a good thing but um against young players like tomato you just can't relax for a second i think in the first she just came out like lightning and um Credit to her, she played really well, but uh, just try to, you know, to stay positive, I think, and it, when it gets to that point, whoever stays positive and keeps trying to play the right squash is who normally comes out on top. She also had a boast that was working very well, and I was wondering was it anything about the, the not seeing the boast, or was she just hitting it really well? Yeah, I was, I was struggling to see it a little bit till, um, quite late, but... As I said, you know, the Hong Kong players throughout the history since I've been playing, they're all very tricky opponents. So um, can never take anyone for granted on tour these days. And I had to play good squash to, to win in two. Joel King, everybody. So Joel King takes it two games to love, but it wasn't without its... Uh, challenges, particularly in the first game as she found her feet and found her way in this new venue in San Francisco. Tomato Ho put up a very good fight. The body language didn't go down and get negative in the second game when she squandered that lead. But she just felt as the, as the end of the second came about, King was kind of going about her business and getting the job done. 